Hey there guys, we are back with some more Let's Try. This time we're playing a game called Card Draw. So this game is a very interesting roguelike deck builder that I've come across. Um, this game is an equation building um, roguelike deck builder. You might be wondering, wait a minute, that sounds boring. That sounds like a freaking nerdy ass game. However, um, we all know um, our own weaknesses. When you see numbers go up and you see it go pop, 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 pop. That is when the dopamine's reach in, and that's where you will enjoy the game. So this game kind of leans into that idea, and yeah, it's very interesting. I played for a few minutes of this just to get, you know, the feel to it. And yeah, you know what's also amazing about this game? You can check out the game right now um, on the itch.io. Uh, itch I will put the links in the description below. And I'm not sure when the demo in Steam would come out, but I'm just going to put the link of the Steam page below. So you can wish this the game for yourself, you know, help the developer, etc., etc. Okay, so you're, you're, the goal here is basically um, just to be able to get as much numbers as possible. And yeah, so right now, um, there is a relaxing mode as well as a strategic mode. Uh, right now, there is like a roguelite mode, but this is not available. There's an idle adventure. And yeah, you could see what the developer was asking for this. But you know what? Let's, let's just jump right into it. Grab your drinks, grab your snacks. Let's play some card draw. I'm playing on the browser right now, so I'm not sure if I cropped it properly. But I think the main elements of the game is... Um, uh, what do you call this? Is or is can be seen here. So yeah, let's use it for a relaxing ga game mode, and let's go with um, 250 draws. So yeah, this is how you play the game. So obviously, um, here is the how many draws you get. The goal is to have as ha much of a high score as possible by the end of the last draw. And how do you get points? Well, we draw a card. So we press space bar or click the deck if you want to. As you can see, times four. No, so we all have zero times four, so we get zero cards. We get plus four, so that is plus four to our points. Plus three, plus four, so you know, it's plus four, plus three, seven. We get seven coins. So we got 11 total now. So you just keep on doing this. And as you can see, as we click in this relaxing game mode, the last number here would be, how do you call this? Would be drop down, and you know, we get increasing and more increasing points. So, right now, it is pretty much early. We're only getting additions basic addition plus seven plus six plus two. However, we get to spend our coins to get, as you can see, additional bigger numbers. So, it's plus 89, plus 41, and times four. So, you know, you could get the idea on what this game does. So, Okay, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, so yeah, that's basically the gist of the game. Get as much points as we can by the end of 250 or 5,000, uh, 500 or 1,000, depending on what you chose. And then in the later parts, the developer would add more game modes to this game. But at least, you know, with this one, you could test it out for free. You could check out the game and the gist of the game, which is amazing. But yeah, let's just keep on getting points here. So honestly, you can just spam if we really want to. And we're getting times two times I times four times two plus seven. By the way, this is following the the PEMDAS rule, wherein you go for multiplication for I know, I think it's left to right, honestly. I'm not really sure. So as you can see, plus two. So yeah, it's plus seven plus two. Uh four that's nine times four. Why is it plus twenty-seven? Huh. Oh seven, I'm not really sure anymore. Uh, wait, there's uh, something wrong here, not 36. Oh, we got 36 total, okay. Oh, I was like, what the hell, plus 27? Okay, I got confused there. Uh, but yeah, for example, if we want to get higher cards, let's, you know, let's get a plus 41. Then we could also draw out, like, refresh the shop, increase the, increase the card slot, or, you know, um, inspect the card. So we could also remove some cards if we want to. Let, let's say if I want to remove the plus one, we could do that as well. So yeah, look at this. So yeah, it's a pretty much simple, relaxing game. And I got so excited to check this game out. So we're not... Ooh, look at this. We got the plus 43. So we need... Okay. How much we're getting? So we, our goal is to get as many of the big cards first rather than multipli multiplying everything. Because the more big numbers that we have, um, the more... Um, the more bigger money that we get. And what's the catch about this game? The money that you choose to spend on the cards is also deducting to your final points. So you must also think when and where to stop buying cards, etc, etc. Anyway, let's try to remove a plus one. 
Look at that. We're gaining some money here. So it's also really satisfying to see all the chips fall into place. So right now, we're just gaining some coins. It would be good if we have a plus... Um, a plus... Um, times 4 there. And then we get... Let's try to get the plus 89 as soon as possible. Like that. Sold out. So yeah, look at this. We can gain a lot of money. Plus 89. A multiplier would be insane. Oh, I imagine if we had a multiplier though. Uh, let's try to refresh the deck here. Equals plus 4-4. Four, four. Ooh. Plus 666 six, six, plus equals 777. Seven, seven. Those are insane numbers. What the hell? Um, let's add a card slot. What's this? Oh, we could add card slots. Okay, that's insane. Let's try to do that. That is insane numbers. Multiplier, nice. Let's add a card slot in the next row. Let's do this. So now we have a card slot. So now you can see it would exponentially increase our value here. Um, let's try to... What's this? Oh, okay, Paul. Okay, we can do that later. Um, let's try to remove a, a low number card here. 520. Okay, let's try to remove the smaller ones that are useless to us right now. That would allow us to have more value. Look at that. We're getting insane amounts of value here. Uh huh. Let's try to add a deck here. Time zero? No, thank you. That is insane for us. Why can't we. We can't burn a card. Okay, so we don't have that much cards. So, yeah, let's just get as much money as we can. Um, we could refresh it if we want to, but. Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, this is much more. Uh, this is much more tolerable. What's this? Increase the input value by largest di digit and minus the smallest digit of the input value raised to power 3. Oh my god, this is so much more complicated than I thought it would be. So yeah, let's get gain some money. Gaining the big numbers. Look at that. Let's remove a plus 4. 1,000. Look at that. Let's try to get this. I wonder what that does to us though. Um, we could also remove this. Hmm. I'm curious what this does, though. So, I don't see any numbers just yet. Hmm. Input time, max digit. I'm not really sure. This is so many tags. I'm not sure if it is worth it just yet. So we need to be able to refresh, or we could get the plus 7,000. That is insane value. If we get the multiplier. Ooh. So it, oh, okay. Uh, input value 40, so it gets 40 from here. Plus 64, oh, oh, okay. That is interesting. Uh, we could get, we could save for 7,000 if we want to though. But I don't think we could afford that. If we could, that would be exponential to our growth though, because that's plus two two two. So yeah, I'm just gonna roll. What I like about this game is like you could just spam spacebar and it would roll for you. Okay, okay, okay. I think we have enough. Yes. And then wait for the 222. Okay, let's try to remove a smaller one. And let's try to refresh the deck here. Equals one that is so sad. Plus 29 is good. It's decent. Length plus 3. Increase the input value by the number of digits of the input raised to the power of 3. Okay. So many complicated numbers. But yeah, really interesting game, all things considered. Um, I think we could remove the plus 7. And then let's just try to increase our value here. We could probably get the plus 64. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Multiplier would be insane. Oh, I imagine if we had a multiplier though. Uh, let's ha add you. And then I think we could try to save up now. Big numbers times 2. Value. That's big value for us. Hmm. 
3 to the power of... That is insane, though. Length squared. Plus 14 is, like, decent. What's this? Is a dice that gets rolled each turn? Oh, okay, that's insane. Imagine if we add 6 to the power of 6. That is insane. Also, yeah, I'm just going to roll. Rolling. Let's add another deck here. Oh my god, those are big numbers. Let's grab that. Honestly, I think our deck is good at the moment. Insane. Seeing numbers go up. Okay, um, honestly, I think we could re-roll here because we can't afford those yet. Those are numbers that are not in our wheelhouse at the moment. <coughs> Excuse me, I apologize. I didn't mute myself. <coughs> okay, we could have more card slots here if we want to. Woo! Woohoo! Okay. Um, I think so far... We really can't afford anything just yet. Hmm. Maybe we could have grab a 3,000. Like re-roll. Plus 89. We could afford that. Astronaut? There are these types of cards in this game? The total of boys multiplied two times number of cards with the land tag on the table. Okay, that length tag. Okay, these are insane numbers. We could see numbers go up real soon here. We could increase our value here. Um, we could like have you grab that, and I think we could try to remove like a plus fourteen. You're really weak at at the moment, and then you know just make sure like we get big numbers. Oh, look at this! Look at this! This insane numbers right here. So yeah, anything, it could exponentially increase our power. L this is not really as good right now that I think about it. So I think we could remove that. Times 4 times 3? 13,000? Okay, okay. Then let's reroll. We could probably get big numbers here. Okay, insane numbers. Let's try to re-roll. Okay. These are too expensive for me, dude. So yeah, I'm just going to roll un until we get like decent amount of money here. And by decent amount of money, I, I mean like re-roll. Oh my god. This is not, not, not looking good for us. You know what? I'm just going to roll until we get 15,000. Okay. Accumulated score. Oh my gosh, look at these numbers, man. Oh my gosh, those are big numbers. Um, okay, you know what? That was pretty interesting. Let's try to restart the game. And try to, you know, have... Let's try to build it for us. I think, okay, these are really good early game. So I'm just going to roll and roll. Hopefully we can get the multiplier. Times four. And then we could get the plus 41. And then let's get the plus f the next one after. So yeah, this is kind of like a game of chance here. As well as a game of hopefully getting the biggest number possible. And then let's get the next one so we could get even more money. And then let's wait till we can afford the 500 one. So let's grab that. Plus 9, really decent. Let's remove the plus 1. Okay. Let's just make sure we get a decent amount. Also, I love how in this game you could see like a tag we're in. Times 1, nope. Um, let's reroll. Okay, now this is good. This is good. Plus 25 is good. This is really, really cheap though. We could use that for like free value. Also, look at this. I like how you could see like a tag whenever you could afford something over here. Let's grab that. Honestly, we could try to afford the plus 80 equals 88 because that's like free 
But I'm not sure you need to draw it like 20 times, I believe, in order to make it worth it. So I'm kind of 50-50 on that at the moment. So yeah, let's try not to do that. Um, let's try to re-roll. Hopefully we can get good value cards here. Times 5 is insane. Times 6 is also insane. You know what's also cool about this game? Like you need to balance out the multipliers as well as like the um like the addition stuff. Because you know you can't multiply O times three. That is so good. Okay, let's try to get this. Pam pam. Try to remove the plus five. And I think we're good here. Like look at the numbers go up. Numbers go up. I am happy. I don't think we could afford that just yet, though. Avocado. Okay. I'm gonna try to reroll. Maybe you could find like bigger numbers. Those are too big of a numbers for us. Okay, this is much more tolerable. Why do we need this equals one though? Like, why do we need that? Grab that. That is insane value for us. Maybe we could afford like reroll once again. Hmm, this is decent. That's seven eight thousand though, so I think we could do that. Let's look at that. Look at the numbers go up, dude. Ooh, times six. Look at that insane numbers. Okay. I think we could try to afford getting the minimum plus maximum number. Look at this. Those are big numbers. Okay, let's try to grab this one. This one guy. Oh, baby, a time six. That is insane big numbers for us. 11 times third digit. Hmm. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Multipliers, guys. Plus 18 is like decent. But I think that we could get a plus 42 much better for us right now. Oh my god. Time 6, 5, 5, 5. Oh, ah. Numbers, I see numbers go up. I am immediately happy. Um, just remove this, just remove this, remove the times two, and then I think we're good at the moment. Ooh, ooh, oh, look at the numbers, look at the numbers, baby. What do the numbers mean, Mason? So yeah, this would be really satisfying. So yeah, if you want to try this out, be sure to check out the links in the description below. We got to, right, to 222 here. So yeah, if you're enjoying this, be sure to you know check out the game for yourself. Try to get as high a score as you can. Honestly, I'm just going to roll some points here. And just like that. <laughs> oh man, wow, but look at the best turn though. So yeah, this is a really simple game. Hopefully you enjoy this game because, you know, and plus it's free. You can check out the game um, on Steam as well as in Itch. It's free. You don't need to install anything. You can just play it on your browser, which is cool. Um, but yeah, and we thank you again, developer, for reaching out. Hopefully you enjoyed this game, guys. If you did, be sure to click that like button. Subscribe and more. I upload new every day. Be sure to check them out as well. And as per usual, have a great day today. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.